Okay, so we completed part one of our smile um, and we got some lovely Christmas cards back from the neighbours. Say so thank you, uh, which was a yay. Um, so we have smile number two to come up next week. Uh, so prep has started already to get that ready to put into place. Um, so basically when we moved in here about two and a half years ago, um, the bin men are just amazing. Um, so you know when you move house and you just have piles and piles of rubbish that you realise that you've got and you don't need and all the packing stuff that you've used. Um, so literally we had this massive box and I just kept shoving things in it, loads and loads and loads, and thinking, oh yeah, I'll go to the tip when I remember, and it was just clogging up space. Um, and I remember just one morning I saw the bin men arrive, um, and oh, I forgot to put the bin out, so I ran outside and I pulled the bin down, um, and he said, good morning, just really, really nice and cheery. Um, and so I just cheekily asked, oh, do you mind taking this box of rubbish? So he was like, all right, yeah, if you're quick. So I was pulling this big, massive box out, um, and he happily just took that away for me, which was just a massive help and saved me the trip, especially with the newborn baby. Um, so that was like, all oh, right, that's really cool. Um, and since then, they're just always so helpful. Uh, sometimes I've forgotten to put the bin out, and they've come up the driveway and taken it themselves. Um, I've seen them um, across the road put their bin back in their yard um, and it's just those little tiny things which just make your life so much easier and they probably don't even realise they're doing it um, but it is just those little things help you out and put a smile on your face. So again, as it's Christmas, um, it's time to say thank you. Um, so we're going to give them a little treat. So we have a little... Morning guys, thank you very much. Little letter to explain what it is about. Um, and then we have gifts. Um, so we've got some lovely beer. Maybe not appetising. Um, and then, of course, because it's Christmas and everybody loves a mince pie, we have mince pies. Um, so we are going to put these in a gift bag for them uh, with the notes. La la la. Um, and just leave that on top of the bin on Tuesday for them, uh, ready to pick up and just say thank you. Um, we'll have a mince pie on the rest of the route and then when they get home, enjoy a beer. Um, so yeah, so that is smile number two to be put into operation next week and uh, we'll let you know how it goes. Okay, thank you. Okay, so the bin is out um, and so it's time to go and drop off the gift. Okay, so and then hopefully we can cut them picking it up and hopefully seeing some smiles on their faces. I'll leave this on here. It's got, hopefully they'll read the note and realise it's for them. Um, and then yeah, we'll see their smiles, yeah! And it was a success, yeah. Um, so much fun to do. Um, it was quite nerve-wracking um, and exciting at the same time, waiting for them. Um, so we'd put the bag outside uh, ready, um, and then we'd set the camera going. Um, and we were just waiting. <laughs> me being me, I was sat there. I'd got up at six o'clock in the morning, that excited. Um, and obviously it's pitch black at this time. So I was like, oh, I wonder what time they're going to come. So I'm sat there, and I'm sat there. And obviously it's dark until like 8 o'clock and it's like, well, they're not going to come in the dark. And so yeah, so about 8 o'clock on the dark, um, they saw the orange lights and it's like, oh my god. Um, so yeah, so I was so embarrassed in case they saw me uh, that we ran upstairs to watch them. Um, so I couldn't really see them, but all we heard was like this laugh when they saw the bag and read the note, which was just so fun and so nice to hear. Um, so yes, really, really good one today. Um, very happy. Uh, yeah, and it's just it's just the fact that you know these guys are having to work over Christmas, which a lot of people are having to do, um, and so you know it's just nice to give them a little something as they're doing their job. I used to work in retail for many years over Christmases, and um, yeah, and it's just these little things like if you know in your local shop, go and give them a box of biscuits for the Christmas week, um, or some chocolates, or you know. 
these girls and lads are having to work their jobs up until Christmas. I mean, we were working until Christmas Eve and they were able to put sale on and stuff like that. Um, and just to take them something like a box of chocolates or biscuits or whatever uh, would just, you know, make their day and stuff like that. So, you know, something as simple as that, um, you know, means the world to people sometimes. And um, so, yeah, really, really fun to do. Um, next mile is in operation. Uh, so that's getting all planned for next week. Um, but until then, uh, Merry Merry Christmas. Um, hope everybody has a lot of smiles on Christmas Day. Um, ours is obviously a lot about Frankie, well, all about Frankie on Christmas Day. Um, and we'll be seeing her smile as she opens all of her presents off Santa. Um, and no doubt we'll be playing with all the toys and whatnots um, all on Christmas Day. Um, and there'll be lots and lots of smiles with that. Um, so, yeah, have a Merry Christmas. And uh, we'll see you next time. Bye.